My name is Kirsten Johnson and I'm coming to you from a little hospital in rural Newfoundland. I just finished an incredibly busy day where I saw 30 patients, most of whom had not had regular access to a doctor for years. Diabetes was left unchecked, osteoporosis not treated, depression not medicated, and acute problems are managed by a doctor from another town far away on an iPad. There is no ultrasound, and basically anything acute that needs immediate attention involves a two-hour drive to the nearest center with a doctor. The people are lovely. The mayor came in to greet me this morning. I have received care packages, and everyone asked me to stay. It is an understatement to say that these people need doctors. On the flip side, it took me seven months to get my license to practice here. It involves many hours of my own admin, online learning courses, emails, two visits to get my documents notarized, and cost me many thousands of dollars. I am also licensed in two other provinces in Canada, and I'm not sure I can afford the cost of annual licensing fees going forward. Medical licensing should not be a barrier to getting Canadians the health care they need. The federal government is injecting money into the provincial health care systems, and some of it should go to easing the burden of licensing. A national license, especially in these times of health care crisis, is essential. If you agree, like this post and raise your voice. We need to move this issue forward now.